Suddenly I remember how long this was, too. Very, very, very long. Oh my god, this is the longest hallway in the game. Ah yes, a new purple hallway, and you even bigger purple hallway. Goodbye. So long, I can't forget about you as well, third purple hallway. Of the 99 purple hallways. And again, I don't think there's anything over here, but just to be- <gasps> She left the fireplace on after she left. This is a fire hazard. Her house is gonna- She left the pie out! How long have I been gone? There are dog prints in it. She let the dogs eat the pie. This is ridiculous. This is a fire hazard. Toriel, you're going to jail. The fire isn't burning hot, just pleasantly warm. You can put your hand inside. Okay, never mind, Toriel. You won't go to jail. But I would still consider that a dangerous hazard. Ribbit, ribbit. Seems like the ruins have finally opened up. Maybe we should finally go over out to the rest of the underground. Go out to the rest of the underground? Oh, wait, no, okay. I thought it was the ruins. Huh? The barriers open up too. Uh, let's just take it one step at a time, okay? A frog can only do so much. I wish we never got to go over there. <gasps> oh, but there are frogs, so it's worth it. Ribbit, ribbit. Yellow names were nice for a while. Next time, we should try a relaxing shade of green. Oh, yeah, because they have the mercy names. Ribbit, ribbit. Did you ever find this room's fourth frog? Ribbit, ribbit. Say, now that your journey's over, maybe you'll have to have time to listen to me. Since most pe people just press X to skip through my dialogue. That's right, pressing X. You've really matured, haven't you? Yes, I have. Did I ever find the fourth frog? Looks like Cheese has a nibble taken out of it. <gasps> Mr. Mouse! You did it! Determination has been made! I have to check out the uh, the arcane one, too. <gasps> the exit's open. Guess I better roll out. Hey, you mind giving me a push, pumpkin? Uh, sure. How do I push you? I'm trying to push you. I can't. I'm sorry! The cave won't let me. Bum, 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 Mr. Frog! Ribbit, ribbit. Excuse me, human. You seem like you have grown into a thoughtful and consentious person. Whether that was from my advice or not, I'm quite proud. Ribbit. If I do the genocide route and come back, what happens? Another long purple hallway. The longest of the purplest hallways. Whoa, okay. I do not remember this area. Not remember those funky stairs. I thought that was the starting area for a second. And oh, hello, friend. Golden flowers. They must have broken your fall. Don't worry about me. Someone has to take care of these flowers. That's it. Chris, please just leave me alone. I can't come back. I just can't, okay? I don't want to break their hearts all over again. It's better if they never see me. You're just a huge downer, dude. Why are you still here? Are you trying to keep me company? Frisk. Okay. Let me ask you a question. Frisk, why did you come here? Everyone knows the legend, right? Travelers who climb Mount Ibot are said to disappear. Frisk, why would you ever climb a mountain like that? Was it foolishness? Was it fate? Or was it because you... Well, only you know the answer, don't you? I never actually thought about that. I know why Tubbs climbed the mountain. It wasn't for a very happy reason. Oh, Frisk, I'll be honest with you. Tubbs hated humanity. Why they did, they never talked about it. 
but they felt very strongly about that. Tubbs was six years old. How do you hate humanity at six years old? Maybe Tubbs wasn't six years old. I'm six years old, though. Frisk, you really are different from Tubbs. You really are different from Tubbs. I don't... You are different. In fact, though you have similar uh, fashion choices, which is kind of weird given the amount of time in between, probably. I don't know why I ever acted like you were the same person. Frankly, it just confused the entire story. Maybe the truth is... Tubbs wasn't really the greatest person. How dare you? Well, Frisk... You're the type of friend I wish I always had. So maybe I was kind of projecting a little bit. Let's be honest. I did some weird stuff as a flower. <laughs> did some weird stuff as a flower. That's a sentence. There's one last thing I feel like I should tell you. Frisk, when Tubbs and I combined our souls together, the control over our body was actually split between us. They were the one that picked up their own empty body. They were the one that picked up their own empty body. And then, we get to the village. They were the one that wanted to... to use our full power. I was the one that resisted. And then because of me, we... Well, that's why I ended up a flower. Frisk. This whole time, I played myself for that decision. That's why I adopted that horrible view of the world. Kill or be killed. But now, after meeting you, Frisk, I don't regret that decision anymore. I mean, I still kind of regret that decision a little bit. When you kill a lot of people, I did the right thing. I, I don't think you could say that. If I killed those humans, we would have had, a, had to wage war against all of humanity. Oh, okay. And in the end, everyone went free, right? I still feel kind of sad knowing how long it took. So maybe it wasn't a perfect decision. But you can't regret hard choices your whole life, right? Well, not that I have much of a life left. You're just really bumming the mood out, aren't you? That's besides the point. Frisk, thank you for listening to me. You should really go be with your friends now, okay? Oh, and please. In the future, if you, uh, see me, don't think of it as me, okay? I just want you to remember me like this. Someone that was your friend for a little while. Oh, and Frisk. Be careful in the outside world, okay? Despite what everyone thinks, it's not as nice as it is in here. Yeah, I know! I know! There are a lot of flowies out there. There's so many flowies! Those monsters are doomed! Doomed! Not everything can be resolved by just being nice. Frisk! Don't kill and don't be killed, alright? That's the best you could strive for. Well, see you. I hate to break it to you, but I kind of have been killed quite a few times already. Frisk! Don't you have anything better to do? Frisk! Seriously, get out of here! Stop stepping on my flowers! This is my garden! Why are you ruining it, Frisk? You're so mean! Ugh. Oh, what was that? Golden flowers, the muscles broken your fall. Oh wait, this is just looking at the flowers. Just in case, gotta do the spammy thing. Was he implying that Frisk... So, is Frisk the villain? Asriel and Frisk became a single entity, which became Flowey. And the evil part was apparently... Or, not Frisk, sorry. Tubbs was the one that became Flowey and Asriel. And Tubbs's part was the evil part of Flowey and the good part of Flowey, even though there wasn't really any good part of Flowey, was the... Was Asriel? Uh, but Toriel and Asriel don't have a child because they don't age, but the kid's Asriel's name is Asriel, which is Toriel and Asriel combined. And my name's Frisk, but I, I named my character Tubbs. The monst monsters? Free. Free monsters. Humans. Yup. Video games. I have to walk through this entire hallway again. 
just to say goodbye to Onion Sam. But it'll be worth it. I'm coming, Onion Sam! There's an ant-sized frog in a crack in the wall. It waves at you! I almost didn't say goodbye to you. Goodbye, ant-sized frog. Oh, won't the, won't the reactor explode now that the wolf isn't throwing ice into the... into the reactor? Hey, you! I didn't say goodbye to you. This is an echo flower. It feeds the same thing... Meat, huh? Meat, huh? Yeah, but... We're going to the surface! Like, you don't need echo flowers anymore, dude. Wait, is this a door back here? It is, but I can't get to it. Yes, you! I want to say goodbye to you! Three gold for the fairy. Hop on. But hey, what about, like, going to the surface, Mr. Squishy Thing? Thanks for stepping on my face. Here's the three gold. You got three gold! Yes, the cheese! Seems like the mouse has freed some of the cheese from the crystal somehow. Good job, Mr. Mouse. So it seems like all the mice got the cheese. I wish the save files here had changed, like seeing that the mouse got the cheese fills you with even more determination. Maybe he's with the band, though. They mentioned- somebody mentioned the band. onion on. Hello! I want to talk to you! Please say something to me. <gasps> I've been wondering when we're all gonna be free! S since if we did, how would I ever know? I'm here to tell you this! Well, I'll keep my tentacles out for you, you hear? As soon as I know, I'll be the first to tell you, you hear? My, my character's not gonna tell him. Hello? Frisk! Frisk, you have to tell him! Frisk! Tell Onion Son! <laughs> Come on! Please! It's gotta be any day now! Okay, maybe if I go back and forth, he'll, he'll tell him. He's so lonely. Look at those eyes! You can't leave him down here! Oh, no. Frisk, you're terrible. This is a terrible ending. I hate this ending now. This is the bad ending. Ah, there's the monster. I can't talk to you. Why is that? How do I... Miss, Miss Fish Lady. I would like a word. Alright. Oh! It's good to be with my sister again. Part of me wants to see my new brother, Aaron. But most other parts of me don't. Do we not like Aaron? Why don't we like Aaron? It's good to be with my sister again. Oh my god, you're terrifying. Fish lady! Why can't I talk to you? I think that is the kingdom, right? It must be. <gasps> hey! You came all this way to see me flex? I did. This really says something about you. Yeah, let's look at that. Look at that last flex. Hmm. I did come all this way to see you flex. Can you flex me up that up that wall? No, you cannot. I have to go all the way back. Hooray. I'm glad I got to talk to him one last time, I suppose. Not upset about this at all, and I put my umbrella back, so I'm gonna get all wet now. <gasps> there was somebody down here. Wash you. Don't drag your dirty feet in here. I just cleaned this trash. Good job, Wash you. And farewell. Hey, it's a Geodude. Gah, who are you? I don't- who are you is the better question. Freedom? What? Bah! You're pulling my leg. I don't remember fighting you or seeing you at all. What is this? I don't remember this either. It's a box. Presumably to be pushed. Doesn't... Can't... Can't seem to push it. Alright. Fair... Goodbye, box. I've come to say goodbye, monsters. <gasps> oh. oh, freedoms. Feels so spicy. That's the spicy freedoms. <gasps> oh, but there's people now. Hey, what's up, hot guy? 
<laughs> if we leave, no one will really ever know. If we leave, no one will really ever know. The lava's so spicy now. Lava gets spicy? Is anybody over there? No. Hey, did you hear? The barriers opened up. Now school has to be canceled, right? Perhaps. There will be lots of places to loiter on the surface, I bet. It's true. There's many a place to loiter. These guys! There's a guy in here too, right? Yes, this is the guy I was thinking of. So we're all gonna go free? Does that mean I don't get to go to work? I guess. That's like every monster's main question. Do I have to go to work? Today we all started as co-workers. Who knows what will be tomorrow? Bear is opened up, so we don't have to go to work today. I mean, sure, we're free, but it's the little things, you know? You guys never went to work. You guys... You guys have sat here for, I think, days? I'm not really sure how time progresses in... in Undertale, but it, it seems like you've been there for days, if not weeks. I'm an idiot. It was just that. It was just go down and go back up. I hate everything. Me, most of all. Ah, yes, the cheese! Seems like the mouse hacked the safe and took the cheese out! Oh, you got the full cheese! Good job, Mr. Mouse! Please tell me there is somebody down here. There isn't anybody down here. Oh, there is! Thank you! Ha ha ha! Wonder if any humans would want to be my friend! Psych! That never happened! Ha ha! You're right! I would never be your friend. This was a lot longer. I wish... I kinda wanted to solve one of these puzzles. I wish that gave me a chance. Aha! Hooray! Surface World will have so many new friends to help. What do you need help with? Aha! We were hired by Metaton to destroy you. But since he never paid us, we all decided to quit. No hard feelings. Which makes me want to double check. The link works already subscribed too. Thanks if you're still there. Yes, perfect. As a youth, I would sneak out to play by this creepy flaming pit. Since the core is always rearranging, it was like a game trying to find it. As my special place, it is nice for cooking s'mores and things like that. This is a nice place to cook s'mores, although... It is in a reactor, so I think there's some chemical gases? Maybe maybe not cook s'mores. Maybe don't cook s'mores there. That, that seems dangerous. It's taking a nap. Aha! That's what I thought. Why do I look like a black sausage and not a knight or a wizard? Well, everyone has an angle they look best from. This is your best angle? Alright. I won't question it. Yes! The core is made up of interchangeable rooms. Before you came here, the layout was altered so you would get lost and perish. Yes, just for you. Do you feel special? I do! Not. I don't feel special at all. This was a very confusing maze, which, now that I look at it, doesn't really seem to do much. The cave structure kind of confuses me. I didn't talk to any of you guys. Hello, Frisk. Galfus upgraded my phone. I am having a lot of fun with the texting feature. Sans, check out this one. Oh man, Tori. That's brutal. I can't believe the queen has returned. And also that she's a huge dork. You two are two feet away from each other. Why are you texting? Worry not, Papyrus. We are texting for a good reason. Why is that? Well, because we're huge dorks. Sans, please don't say that. You are not a dork. You're more of a boathead. <laughs> wow! Those puns are even less funny coming from her. Why are you smiling? It's a pity smile! Can I actually call them now? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna join in on the jokes. Notice you received a text from Toriel. Dear Frisk, Sans and Elphys are teaching me how to text. I am learning so much. For example, do you know what a smiley is? Please look at this. They gasp. It is a smiley with horns. Now turn your head to the left. It is a picture of me smiling at you. Can you see it? 
L-O-L. That stands for lots of laughter. Sincerely, Toriel. That's all for now. Maybe in the next room you will receive another. Oh, God. How are you? You have been wandering around... Um, you've been wandering around for quite some time now. I hope you are not getting into trouble. Only kidding, lol. Sincerely, Toriel. P.S. Do not get into trouble. I will murder you. Toriel sent you a message. Excuse me. I did not mean to write sincerely. I meant to say sincerely. It is difficult to use this with large hands. <laughs> Perhaps I should ask Sans to transcribe for me. She's still sitting there looking at me as she texts me. Sans will be typing from now on. Hey Frisk, it's Toriel. I just baked ten... one million pies. Do you want any? Make sure to brush your teeth before crossing the street. Frisk. I did not say any of that. <laughs> Greetings. This is Sans. Oh. I love my brother very much. Oh, wait, this is Toriel. Help, I am being slandered. <laughs> I don't know who this is. This is Sans. Frisk, did you know that I love to get owned? I also think Toriel is very good and... <laughs> Excuse me. Todd. Inside, she meticulously describes a video she saw of a small white animal. There's no link or attachment to watch it. We're gonna keep going! Send this to someone you care about, or a skeleton will rattle his bone at you. Bones at you. I should probably try... No response. Their phone might be out of batteries. Oh, thank god I didn't want to go through this all again. Dear Frisk, thought you might be enjoy this. I did not. It's assy, a s c i i art of a snail. I didn't, I didn't see the snail. I thought it was a smiley face again. Dear Frisk, Undyne and Papyrus want to cook something together with me. Sans tells me that they, they are excellent chefs. I am excited. Maybe if you are lucky, you could have some. A <laughs> fat chance. Okay. If Sans and I started a band, do you know what we could call it? Dreamer and Femur, LOL. P.S. That is only a joke. Do not refer to me as Dreamer. <laughs> Too late, Dreamer. To frisk, Undyne is very strong. Papyrus made me a bet with her that she could not lift everyone here up. She could. The only trouble is that she did not know how to put everyone down. Aw, oh, I was hoping I'd walk in and they were just holding everyone. Dear Frisk, Alphys is telling me many interesting facts about the human world. Quite a few of them are wrong, though. Frisk, you did not tell her anything funny, did you? I may have told her anime is real, but I may have told Undyne anime is not real. Dear Frisk, I heard that you're using the computer for too long. It's bad for you. However, I have not seen you use the computer at all. You must be very healthy. How nice. Hmm. <laughs> clever, clever game creator. Very clever. Dear Frisk, I think I may have to turn off the phone for now. Oh, thank God. Your friends are all very lovely people. I think I will spend this time getting to know them better. Be good, alright. Sincerely, Toriel. Toriel has not sent any more messages. Thank you. Frisk, do not feel left out. I have been writing messages to you as well. You still have my num phone number after all this time, do you not? I threw it away. Hey, Frisk, what's with that weird expression? Sans, did I tell you about the time Frisk flirted with me? I did indeed. And then asked to call me Mother. Oh boy. Wow. <laughs> wow, Frisk. This really puts our relationship in a new light. Hey, Tori. 
Yeah, many other embarrassing stories. Oh, do I ever. But I think that story is one of the most unbelievable. It is hard to think anyone would want to flirt with me. <laughs> ah, Toriel, you have no idea. <laughs> Sorry, I don't have time to talk, Frisk. I'm supposed to be working right now. But you aren't working! I know. It's taken all my concentration. Frisk, how about you look around before we all go? See how many friends you have you've made here. I am almost certain you must have made some more. Oh, please stop talking. <laughs> please stop giving me new things. Oh, thank you. Sorry, I'll have to talk. Okay. Four more. So, Asgore, how about making me a member of the Royal Guard? Well, Papyrus, now that the war is over, we might not need the Royal Guard anymore. The what? Then what was the point of the human's quest? They journeyed all that way? And I'm still not a member of the Royal Guard? Truly, this is the worst possible ending. It's true. It seems like you really botched your quest, Frisk. But I, the Great Papyrus, will always be your friend. Even if you are terrible. No matter how hard you try to get rid of them. Hey! That's true. Frisk, why don't you take a walk around? Frisk, why don't you fly? It's faster. Yeah, Frisk, why don't you fly? Flying sounds a little bit dangerous. But they can't fly. Not with that attitude. Frisk, take a hike. Hiking is good for your bones. I'm sick of talking to you. Person that literally saved us all from dying. I don't want to talk to you anymore. Some friends I have. So, Elphys. What do you want to do now that we're all free? We have the whole world to explore now. D well, of course, I'm going out and... Dumb. No, I should be honest. I'm gonna stay inside and watch anime like a total loser. <laughs> That's the spirit. Everyone, a celebration to losers. <laughs> Papyrus has the right idea. Losing to Frisk is the best thing to ever happen to me. So I'm glad that we... Uh, what is it, Asgore? Um, what's an anime? Oh my god! Frisk, please! Help me explain what anime is to Asgore! You see, it's like a cartoon, but... With swords, with guns. I like... Uh, the one she likes has guns, I think. So it's like a cartoon, but with guns. <laughs> Golly, that sounds neato. Where is this? Where can I see the anime? Um, hold on, uh, I think I have someone on my phone. Here, look at this. It's called uh, Bible Black. You'll love it. No, uh, dumb. That's the. That's the wrong. <laughs> uh, never mind. Golly, <laughs> were those two robots. K kissing? Boy, technology sure is something, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it sure is. Okay, let's keep going. Dalphus, Dalphus! Do you think we could watch something with fighting next? Oh, and then something with princesses? To fighting princesses? I'll, I'll see if I can manage to find any like that on Dine. Yay! Day, day! You gotta see fighting princesses! Hey, Frisk, why don't you go say I had a nap stamp look? Oh, tell them I said I too. I'm not going back to say I had a nap stamp look. I already said hi to him. 
Frisk! Dumb, you've gotta tell me. Do, do you think Asgore and Tell Toriel are uh never gonna get back together? Uh probably not. Asgore did kill me like eleven times, and Toriel's kind of all about not killing me eleven times. Yeah, that's what I thought. A woman can dream though, right? Oh god, she's she's shipping them. Dad write a fan fiction. A lot of fan fiction. On second thought, maybe I won't write fanfics of real people. I mean, is a real life already the greatest fanfiction of all? No. Uh, don't tell anyone why I said that. Because I'm going to post it online. Oh, God. I sure am excited to finally use the human internet. I bet they have all sorts of things Undyne and I can watch. You've been watching monster anime? There's monsters that produce anime? Oh, man. We're going to be able to watch anime online. Now, of course, Undyne. What do you think we've been fighting for all along? Smug look. Yeah, what do you... Whoops. Jinx! I knew you were gonna make that joke. Wait, Alphys, I didn't know you knew Sans. Well, I have cameras all over the underground world, so I've kind of just been stalking literally everyone. I see everything. Doesn't everybody? Who the hell is Sans? Who the heck is Sans? What? Toriel? What was that? Hey, Frisk, why don't you go look for Metaton? He was here for a while, too. But he said he had to go somewhere. Why did you say a swear word, Goat Mom? I don't think anybody else has said a swear word in this entire game. Howdy, Frisk. I'm the only person that doesn't destroy your vocal cords when I talk. Sorry about almost trying to take your soul. <laughs> Sorry for killing you 11 times. Oh, yeah, no problem. We feel very bad about it. Oh, yeah. I've still got the stab wounds. They feel very bad, too. I hope we can still be pals. No. Hey, don't worry about it, Asgore. I think everybody's tried to kill Frisk at least once. Sans hasn't. Alphys hasn't. Everybody else has. Arguably, Alphys did make a robot that tried to kill me. <laughs> oh, I see. In that case, I'm not sorry. <laughs> Dazgore, that's not what I meant. Frisk, I just realized. Now that we aren't fighting each other, I could finally ask you. Would you like a cup of tea? Would you like a cup of tea? Sure. Oh, well, I don't have any. Actually, the cup I had is cold now. You shouldn't have it. But... I'm so happy you said yes. Oh. As soon as I can, I will make you some more for you. Then we can be great pals. With tea. Oh, Frisk, if you're not busy. On nice days, you should walk around and have a good time. That's important. Oh, Frisk, if you're not busy, on nice days, you should walk around. That's important. You know what? Just screw you guys. They're just all trying to kick me out. Ugh, we don't want to talk to Frisk. I see how it is. He saved the world and set us free from enslavement. Ugh, we don't want to hang out with him. I'm just gonna stand here and chill. Am I supposed to walk this way? Okay, here we go. If you leave here, your adventure will really be over. Your friends will follow you out of the underground. Except for Onion Sand, because he doesn't know. I'm ready. Did I save? Doesn't matter. This is the end. Oh, bye. Isn't it beautiful, everyone? 
Wow, it's even better than on TV. Way better. Better than I ever imagined. Oh, they're all gonna get sunburned. They haven't seen the sun in forever. They're gonna... Oh, God, they have such ultra-sensitive skin. Frisk, you live with this? The sunlight is so nice, and the air is so fresh. I really feel alive. Hey, Sans! What's that giant ball? We call that the sun, my friend. That's the sun? Wowee! I can't believe I'm finally meeting the sun! I could stand here and watch this for hours. Sunburn! Sunburn, people! I don't know if skeletons get sunburn. Yes, it is beautiful, is it not? But we should really think about what comes next. Oh, right. Everyone, this is the beginning of a bright new future. An era of peace between humans and monsters. You haven't established peace with the humans yet. Frisk. I have something to ask of you. Will you act as our ambassador to the humans? I'm six years old. They're not gonna... I... I... I have to, but... Yeah, Fisk will be the best ambassador. And I, the Great Papyrus, will be the best mascot. I'll go make a good first impression. No. No. No, that's not a good idea. Well, someone's gotta keep them from getting into trouble. See you guys. That's... He went the wrong way. Man, do I have to do everything? Papyrus, wait! Hey, Undyne, wait up! Oh. Whoops. What do you mean, whoops? Uh... <laughs> should I do something? <laughs> it kind of ruined the mood. Well... Gotta go! It seems that everybody is quite eager to set off. Frisk, you came for this world, right? I'm, honestly, I'm not even sure anymore. So you must have a place to return to, do you not? Again, I... I do not know. What will you do now? Want to stay with you? I have places to go. Hmm. I feel like... I get the one guy implied... Ezreal, when we talked to him, sort of made it sound like there would be a reason for him to jump down. I wonder if there is something. I'm gonna say I want to stay with you. The what? Frisk. You really are a funny child. If you had said that earlier, none of this would have happened. It is a good thing that you took so long to change your mind, though. <laughs> well, I suppose. If you really do have any other place to go, I will do my best to keep care of you for as long as you need. Alright. Now come along. I am six years old. I, I should not be walking around the the human world by myself. Everyone is waiting for us, even if I did conquer the monster world in a nice way. It's not It's not gonna work in the human world as well. It's better that I have a mommy. Alright, so I was told to avoid the Kickstarter names. I can't seem to move. So, that's a thing. Professional frog. Braver every day. Reformed bully. Backup dancer. Oh, is this what they do when they're off the surface now? Popular nutritionist. Casually enjoys life. Oh, Napstab look. By Toby. Spooky DJ. Oh, it got faster. Oh, the duck came with us. Papyrus. By Toby and Tammy. Sans. By Toby. 
special inspiration, J.N. Wheedley. Wheedley? Widely? I don't know. I'm still waiting for it. I'm still waiting to dodge the names. Thinking about the tat, semi-successful comedian. Wait a second, some of these- that one wasn't yellow. Why was that one not yellow? Do I have to go back and read the- that one wasn't yellow. Why wasn't it yellow? These ones aren't yellow either! Did I mess up? I- I- mercy to everybody, why aren't those yellow? <gasps> Onion San! He made it! He finally made it! It's all gonna come true! And they're about to hold hands! Oh, they got a smooch! Alphys is dead! Shit! <laughs> and the puppers are puppering, and she is destroying property and probably going to jail. I don't want to press Z because I'm afraid it's gonna skip things. See, that one's not yellow either! What does yellow mean? Don't understand. Legendary Janitor Temmie! Fives! Goodbye, Temps! Calm down just a bit. Oh, good for him. Ooh. Ooh, what's this? <gasps> Napstab looks in a band! And it's pretty okay. And the burger guy's there too, as a bush. He finally made it to the spotlight. Playing by Toby. Finally confesses what I don't. Purchase space TV. Spider success with a new bakery. She's probably gonna be like a billionaire in the human world selling donuts like that. Rail guards use your imagination, but I think they got married. Long battle finally ended. Good job, wins a lot. forgot about Night Night. Oh, maybe the yellow ones are the ones that Toby made, and the... Oh god, the Amalgalama de Badabadas living with their family. Good for them. <laughs> I want to make a papyrus bush. <laughs> Oh, is he living with the- Oh, school! Okay, Toriel got to get a school. Things did work out. Did they plug up the cave? That seems important. Hi. Ha 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 ha. Did you really think it was over? Ugh. I mean, we haven't even done the special thanks yet. Ready? Let's end all this for good. You can still turn into a super ultra cosmic being. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Oh, God. Okay, so I'm not supposed to get- I already blew it. I wasn't supposed to get hit by anything for that door. I think. Does that mean I have to start this all over? What am I supposed to do with this? Oh, this apparently. Crap. 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 No. This is re This is how you get that door? You have to do all of this without getting hit once? Or without touching the names? This is so fast. I'm doing so good at this part. Just kidding. The moment I said that, I blew it. The moment I said it, I blew it. What is this? Oh, okay. That part was good. I hope I can redo this. No, no. Come on. Yep. This is messing with my brain like crazy. Alright, I'm usually... Pretty, uh, just kidding, I'm usually pretty bad at these ones, haha! -ha. Damn, 
dang it, dang, no, no, please! I'm so bad. Alright, this one wasn't too, just kidding, it was the worst. Why didn't I eat a CT? Oh, no, that one was too big. That door better be worth it to have me dodge all of this stuff. I'm pretty sure, yeah, there's... This would take me hours to get without hitting anything. Oh! Touched credits. That's not as many as I thought, that's pretty good. But it's too many. One of those said something like, name redirected. Thanks to friends and families for supporting us in Undertale Team. Thank you, the player, from the bottom of our hearts. Without you, all of this would be impossible. Good night. I'm not going to bed. How did you know it was nighttime? Ooh. It's still here. I made it away. Oh. I swear to God, Toriel, if that's not cinnamon. Don't leave it on the floor! Why haven't you learned? It's gonna get germs. Nobody's taught you about hygiene. Ooh. Well, there you go. It looks like that's the end. Thank you guys for watching the series. It was a pretty good game. I really enjoyed it. Unfortunately, we still have to do the genocide route. I'm not sure when I will do that, but I will do it eventually. <laughs> you did it, Machu. <gasps> and there's a doggo! I am awarded with one doggo for my good work. That is all I desired. Aww. I'm afraid that if I close this, I'll be missing something. Well, alright. Again, thank you everyone for watching. Um, this was my first full Let's Play of a video game. Uh, I think it went pretty good. The music's fading. No, it's not. I lied. Uh, definitely a lot of things I still have to work on, but this was a good intro to commentary for me, and I think a couple of people enjoyed it at least, so if you did, thanks. Um, I think next we're either going to play Hollow Knight, uh, a few, or we're going to make a few Final Fantasy XIV videos, because Storm's Load just came out. Uh, so look forward to those. Uh, I will be doing the genocide route. Uh, it probably won't be for a long time, though. Um... Oh, the pupper fell asleep. I kind of like the idea of just waiting a while and getting a fresh start on it when I come back. But, uh, yeah. Hopefully look forward to Hollow Knight or Final Fantasy in the future. Well, on the YouTube side, thank you for watching. If this is the end, if not, something else will pop up in a second. And, uh, be sure to like and subscribe, leave a comment if you think I missed anything, or if you really want to see the genocide route. So yeah, I will see you guys later. Ciao!